Yeah, he's right here. Yes. It's right there. Like, right there. He's right there, dude. He is right. You're about to get him, bro. You are about to get him. What's up, guys? Nick, Slot City Fishing. We're out here at Amelia Island State Park. Uh, we're out here with Chip. Um, he's going to try and put us on the fish today. He brought us to a spot. He said he's had some pretty good luck. Uh, we cast netted some mullet uh, earlier this morning. Uh, we had some other plans, but uh, State Park was closed and uh, we just adapted, <laughs> changed up the plans, and now we're out here. Uh, he brought us to this uh, rock pile right here. Uh, hopefully, it turns out to be good. Ah! What, that fly? Get that dude off me, bro! <laughs> <laughs> getting a bite hold on I gotta go <laughs> I'll call you right back <laughs> Woo! first fish of the day a little whiting how are you sir my yeah. snood was broke off right uh -huh. off. Mm -hmm. if you don't have your if you don't have this on there or a swivel you've lost your sinker too Oh yeah. So that knot is a double overhand knot. I'm going to 80 pounds. One through, one through. Nice. And now, since that, so it's 25 pounds, it's got pit to it. You made it a little stronger. We're going, we're going two. Now you're just latching, and even if this gets bit off, you still have all your stuff. Yeah, that's right. And really even good. if you run in a, a, a sinker, yeah, a regular, you still have the mm. ability to hope you got one off. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a big one. Well, some, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Try to beach around the corner. Top of that nice big run out. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, just sit on the tailgate and run down there. We don't have to pack everything up. Put your guys' stuff in and go around that corner. Uh, to, the, to the mouth of the inlet. Yeah. And uh, sit on that run up. Right. Yeah, I like that idea. Yeah, dude. Nah, man, he's swimming at you. Ah. Uh. Yeah, man, he's swimming at you. Definitely. Oh, dude. Oh, yeah, man, there you go. Come on, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, baby. Oh, 
Yo, that's a good one. That's what we were seeing. There we are. There we are, boys. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. How big was he? 30 and a half. 30 and a half. Call him on a. Uh, that, that was a dead mullet, huh? Yep. Uh, fresh dead yesterday. Awesome. That was the first one too. That was like, hey baby, <laughs> yeah. Let's get that release. Come on, buddy. Come on. Buddy. Man, he was ready. <laughs> That's definitely what I saw out there. Whoa, Torpin! Whoa! <laughs> Holy cow, man! Man, I wish we had. Whoa. He'll hit this spoon if I can get it out there. Yo, that's casting distance. Is it big? Bro! Dang, dude, you're killing it. <laughs> hey, chip second one of the day. <laughs> That's awesome. Thirty-two. Beautiful fish. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's a really good one, man. Walking the dog, and then bam! Dang! I thought it was that tarpon. I did too, dude. I think we all did. It just came out of nowhere. <laughs> well, I, I, he was, I was just reeling him in. Yeah. Walking him in. Yo, there's that freaking tarpon. Dude, I'm on a mission for that tarpon. <laughs> I think we're gonna stay. Are you? Yeah, we're gonna take you back yeah. to your car. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't leave either. <laughs> oh my God, that tarpon is like sitting right there. Back, cast it, cast him. Real mullet. Yeah. And then put those suckers out there. You Damn. guys. Are... Crazy. He's right there. I, I think that there's like a hundred. Yeah, yeah. Now you finish cleaning up and let me cast twice. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <clears throat> That's more than one. All right, guys. Uh, Chip has to go to work. So we're gonna take him back to the truck, but man, we're coming back. There has been tarpon blow up after tarpon blow up, and we just can't leave at a time like this. Me and Jesse have both never seen anything like this. Uh, we've been just casting freaking spoons now. Uh, so we're gonna go drop him off and then tie up these two out and spoons on the 11 foot and 12 foot battalion and launch these dudes. <laughs> it's crazy man for the love of god there has never been a better time to do drone footage we can't take the drone up here though state park, state park. Uh, yeah i don't dude, really know that would be amazing <laughs> we should just do it. <laughs> i'll just fly it up from over here they'll never um, know gentlemen thank you <laughs> love it yeah yeah man as soon as i saw the tarpon i was just like it's full on tarpon. Yeah. <laughs> I quit I quit trying to catch the other fish. Everything else, right? <laughs> but those two redfish were killer. Yeah. But yeah. yeah, man, I know you gotta get it. So we'll chat more of this uh, fish again. Yeah man. Yeah. 
Yo. Oh, what's up, guys? We're back. We got some lunch. We ran out of mullet, and I was having a hard time cast netting them, so we just went out and bought a bunch of uh, frozen mullet. And we're changing up our tactic now. We're gonna throw them on some floats. We got some big old float rigs. The tide's about to switch again. That's when the tarpon started going crazy was when the tide switched, about the first hour of the tide switch. Uh, so it's about to drop again, and I'm hoping that it's gonna push the bait back in. And uh, there's definitely like a trough in the water right here from the tidal movement. So we're gonna go to mullet on the floats, cast them in, and then walk the shoreline as the tide pulls it in. And then just hopefully it drifts into a tarpon's mouth. No, first time. Yeah, if you guys, the cage, like those Cajun Thunders work for like redfish and stuff, but if I, like you got the perfect size circle hook on there. Yeah. I'd recommend like, what's this, like 40 or 60? 40. Yeah, I'd go up to 60 or 80. Yeah. And then, I mean, I'm sure you know how to tie knots. Yeah, 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 yeah. How to tie the FG knot, or ends up like that, and just put them out on a flat line. Gotcha. And then last year, I guess we caught probably 10 or 20 of them. No way. Yeah, I'm probably hooked 30 or 40, so. Wow, man. Dang, I appreciate it. I know we look like total noobs with these popping corks, but we're just using it to float the baits out there. We're not like popping it, popping it. Well, you wanna do that? What? Okay. Change it up, free line. Free line it? Yeah. Just take the, take the popping cork off? Yeah. Let's do it. Huh? Yeah, he's right here. Yo! Ah! He had it. I didn't let him eat. Dang. Yes. Yeah, dude, I, I had him on. He's right there, dude. He is right, you're about to get him, bro. You are about to get him. You are about to get him. <laughs> yo, yo. Did you see him jump? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Can't go now. Hey man, I just wanted to hook one. He jumped and spit it. Yup, straight up, spit it. <laughs> you done? No. You done? Yeah. All right, dudes. That was a grind, man. Had a killer day. Went out to uh, Amelia Island. At first, we were going for like drum and trout and flounder and stuff like that. Uh, Chip ended up catching those bull reds uh, about that same time as when those tarpons started going nuts. So I bailed on trying to catch. Yeah, we pretty much 
uh, 100%. Switched all the friggin' uh, <laughs> shrimps that we had going and changed them to mullets. And then uh, after that, we went and got some grub and yeah, freaking came back. And took a break. I figured, like, if... Like, I haven't landed a tarpon, so, like, if that was happening, that was the opportunity, man. So I went all in on it, and thank goodness, man. Right at the end, I think that that was, like, an example of the fish gods, like... <laughs> hooking us up man because we definitely fished freaking hard today yeah it was like 16 hours or something stupid <laughs> definitely excessive but you got to remember that man like when you go fishing or like when you watch these videos and stuff man you don't catch fish like that unless you put in crazy amounts mm -hmm. of time yeah we definitely uh we were trying and like you said the, the fish gods blessed us <laughs> uh Big thanks to Chip again. If you haven't heard of Chip uh, Brundage, he's a local guide, uh, and he also is the sinker guy. And makes mm -hmm. those crazy um, weights. So the Sputniks, I'll, yeah. I'll put the links <laughs> down in uh, the description right there. So if you want to go on a, a guided surf casting trip, he's definitely the best surf fisherman I've ever met. Uh, and then if you need some sinkers, man, they're, they're killer. Yeah, thanks, Chip. Uh, we recap the day. If now you wanna, if you want to fish with us, man, join the Facebook group. Um, we've already met a bunch of guys on there, and we can totally meet up and go fish. Now it's time for bed <laughs> and a beer first. Yeah, <laughs> we earned it. All right, y'all. Later. <laughs>